got our son a new truck. <laughs> so it's a Ram, 2018 Ram Tradesman. Uh, it's a perfect base model platform to do all the mods and everything that he wants to do to it. So we'll show it to you real quick and see what you guys think. So we found a, a heck of a deal on a 2018 Ram 5.7 Hemi uh, tradesman version and this this truck is in excellent shape excellent condition uh, it's a perfect starter platform to add all the mods that he wants to do it's very clean we've done just a tiny bit of of touch up to you know the dash to to uh, put some mcguire's protectant on it and it's it shines great doors everything's in great condition i uh, really like the black and gray combination color combination but we're gonna try to do a lot of different mods to it and get it all fixed up for him just the way he wants he's got an extensive mod mod list of the things he wants to do so we're gonna slowly go down the list and work on everything but the truck's in very good condition uh, so there's a look at the interior and good starting point to do all the different things on his list and we'll go over some of the mods that he wants to do uh, in just a few seconds so I wanted to jump in and interrupt here for a second and show you some of the cleaning products we use so I used to use armor all for everything but I swapped gear years ago to Meguiar's and really like it a lot better and this this truck as as well as it was taken care of it just needed a little TLC with some of the arm uh, the new Meguiar's products that we use and we use the leather detailer even though this is probably just more vinyl than it is leather uh, it shined it up really good, made a huge difference in everything, and now the dash shines and it looks almost like brand new. There's no issues with it whatsoever. So there's a few spots I've got to touch up where I missed from the other day and get it all nice and cleaned up for him. But yeah, if you guys want to leave any comments down below on what mods you think would be great for a truck like this or what your first mods would be, and as we keep updating this and adding things to it we'll add new videos so think about subscribing and keeping up with the build process here's another look from the driver's seat and the gauges and standard gauges and controls and everything like i said it's super clean condition whoever had it first really really took good care of it uh, door panels everything really no signs of wear and tear on hardly anything in this vehicle so uh, if you want to check out some of the gimbal shots and drone shots we took and then we'll go over some of the mods that we plan to do on it. So it didn't come with any floor mats or either they took them out because maybe they they were messed up from use over the years but we've got a nice set of mopar original floor mats on the way to protect this carpet because it's in pristine condition and then we're going to get it scheduled to get the windows tinted because right now it's clear as clear as a bell and so we're going to get that done first and then see what he wants to do next uh, i think we're going to do one one thing that's really nice about this truck is since it has the base radio in it, 
you can put a nice aftermarket head unit in it and not have to worry about all the different Uconnect features and the vehicle settings and everything. So you can really do whatever you want to with this. That'll be on the list eventually. Getting some hand-free, hands-free controls and uh, voice voice commands and stuff like that, and then upgrade the sound system as we go. And uh, nice center consoles in good shape. Plenty of storage in here. Cup holders, tons of storage behind the seat. For a regular cab truck, it's it's really kind of surprising how much legroom and and space you have in here. And so, uh, I think he's pretty excited about getting started with his mods and and going down the list and checking them off. Engine bay super clean too. Engine runs like a top, so smooth and no noises or issues, vibrations, anything. Whoever had this truck, it was a one owner truck. And whoever had it obviously took very, very good care of it. It's super smooth on the road, driving everything. Of course, it's got the stock wheels and tires. The original owner didn't do a single thing to it. So gonna put some off-road wheels and tires on it really transform the look of the truck and first things first i think a nice set of tinted windows some floor mats and some basic mods to get started but yeah this thing runs so super smooth to be you know five years old now yeah so there again there's the truck as it sits right now wheels and tires stock form pretty much and so as we go along, we'll update you guys on all the different mods and stuff we do to it. So if you're interested, you know, follow along, subscribe or whatnot, so you can kind of see where this truck started and, and where it ends up and all the different things. He's got a pretty long list of mods he wants to do. So, of course, wheels and tires, since these are the stock 17-inch factory wheels still on the, on the vehicle. Uh, exhaust, sound system, all kinds of different things that we'll be doing to the truck. So feel free... Feel free to subscribe if you want to and, and follow along with the build process. Thanks. Have a good one.